Ladies and gents, hello and welcome. My name, of course, is Obed Potato. This is Urban Empire. And uh, today, we are going to try our very best to retrofit a bunch of our districts with the latest and greatest technology. You can see that our demand, our industry, in our industry demand, our uh, residential demand, and our commercial demand are all negative or non-existent. So there's, there's really not very much going on. Um... But basically, I've been raising taxes for a, a, a significant period of time, and it's about time that we finally uh, take that tax money and, and do something that will impact people. And we're going to try our very best to make sure that all of the districts are retrofitted with all of the stuff that they could potentially need. Um, so we need to modify... I always forget the order that we need to do so We need to click Modify District, but that's already happening to which one? That's gonna pass, that's gonna pass, that's good. Which district is this that we're, that we're doing? I can't remember, it doesn't particularly matter, I suppose. Was it Milton? I guess I can only do one, uh, modify one district at one time. Oh well, doesn't particularly matter. We'll wait until this goes past, I guess? I, I, I mean, I still have no idea which district this is because <laughs> I did it in the last episode <laughs> all right well I guess I guess we'll have to wait and see uh, exactly what the hell that's gonna be oh lovely little train heading out over there uh, but yes oh wait demand demand no demand still non-existent that's a uh, that's a reoccurring problem that's fine though combustion the world has seen f has seen first few commercial solutions. The world has seen first few commercial solutions for internal combustion engine. Uh, expanding the roads to increase usage, encourage local production. Let's encourage local production. Uh, so sales demand minus 10%. Good, that means something. Um, we should pass, this should pass, I think. Yeah, this will pass. I mean, we've got the cash to do it. Everything should go very, very smoothly. And here's hoping that that will mean that we can now modify some more districts. So I can upgrade the density. Oh my god, that's going to cost a shit ton of cash. Uh, let's not do that, shall we? Uh, Infrastructure-wise, yes, let's get you on. Let's get you on as well. 1.5k. Okie doke, that's a lot of money. Uh... Can we upgrade? I just want, you know, I want to give everyone everything. Like, that's what I want to do. Although, it seems that people aren't, uh... Wow, holy shit, this, this is costing, this is gonna cost an, an, a, an awful lot of money for all of this infrastructure to get put into place. Like, I did not think, initially, it was going to be as expensive as it is, but that's... That's okay. That's fine. Uh, what are the party support looking like? Free Democratic Party, Young Swiralian, and Syocreatic Party. That's fine. Rumors. What is this? Like your father, you've had little time for romantic relationships, and you rarely attend social events. Now your lack of marriage has sparked rumors about private life. Some with you have no interest in women at all, and what kind of relations you have with female friends. Let people talk. I don't care. I'm, uh, a solitary dude. Minus 15 prestige? Oh. Athletics Championship? Uh, sure. I don't know if that's going to cost me much, but people seem to like it. Okay, cost me a little bit of cash. Okay, well, here's hoping that our cash is not negative for long. Jesus Christ, it's not great. Social Democrats, uh... I'm going to refuse because I want to see how 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 solitary I can really get. I, I'm, there might be something in that. Uh, a famous writer living in Waltondale has become a vocal critic of your politics. You invite him for dinner so that you can have a discussions. Ask him what you could do better. Yeah, I want to know what I could do better. Um, points towards cynical trait. I don't think I don't think that's that's cynical if you take criticism. I think taking criticism is a good thing, you know? Fantastic. Good stuff. All right, what's next? Assembly line, uh, communications advances, dynamite. Uh, let's go for the telephone, actually, since 
we can. Or, in, in fact, no, let's go for, for this one first. Wait a minute. Yeah, okay, yeah, let's go for let's go for this one. The Sautotamona, I don't know, because it gets access to university, which is kind of nice. Um, service funding, can we reduce funding of anything, actually? Oh, I don't really want to spend that much money on anything. Uh, edicts, can we try and introduce an edict? Maybe regulate gambling? Regulating gambling, bonus to fund service, bonus to social life, money that citizens can use on private life. I want a livelihood act. Uh, monthly city fund expenditures to city hall goes up by 15,000. That's not something that I'm really interested in doing. Work safety act, bonus security, sales demand, 5%. I want to get some money that's what i want that's what i want i really want some money work safety act i think we're going to propose this work safety act thing i think we're honestly going to be able to get it passed as well due to the fact that um the political parties are aligned in such a way that um we can we can win all of the votes okay kildridge kildridge what services are there here Bonus to health and bonus to physical environment. Whereas this would just cost a lot of money. Gas street lights will give bonus to physical environment and bonus to security. How can I increase sales though? Like I suppose I could probably start by targeting a uh sure. There we go. That's probably gonna pass. Um I I really need to start targeting the buildings that will be able to make me money. Is there any way that I can check city data for money? Uh, middle class tax, industry tax. Industry tax is absolutely gargantuan. So it's industry and commercial tax, both are absolutely gargantuan. Also working class tax, absolutely gargantuan. Um, so it's in my interest to, it's in my interest to, to, to spend that. Infrastructure, we spend a shit ton of money on infrastructure. We spend a lot of money on districts. Um, infrastructure's the big one, really, to be honest. Infrastructure really is the big one. Let's try and modify this district. And let's see if we can get some electricity over here. Tram line, is that going to make any difference? I don't know if it will. I don't know if it's worth adding a tram line in. Don't really care about physical environment. Sewer system, bonus to health. We don't really care about health in this area. We'll go for something like that. See if electricity can get hooked up. All right. That should pass. I'm going to make the executive decision and fire off a quickened vote there and hope that we get to pass this work safety act i'm very very hopeful that this is going to pass i have no idea why the free democratic party is also voting in favor of this but i'm very very glad that they decided to do such a thing um that's grand that's really really good bonus to security who all the work in the building sales demand of a whole bunch of stuff should increase which may lead to more increase in taxes for us indirectly i'm hopeful anyway Okay, vote on modifying the district. This is almost certainly going to pass. Uh, almost certainly going to pass. What? Overrule this decision, I think. That's a costly waste of prestige that I didn't really need, but this is going to benefit businesses, I hope. Now they've got access to the electricity grid. Oh, look, they're all starting to light up. Oh, that's really cool. That is that is awesome indeed. Okay, Free Democratic Party wins the election. Oh, this is interesting. So, Young Swirlian Party are on 36. Syocratic are on 15, which is actually really good. Huh, okay. Let's have a little look of the seats and see what's up. So, you have got 27. 
you guys have got two. So combined, you guys can't vote down anything. So if I want to go for some left-wing policies, for some, you know, tax increasing policies and stuff, we'll, we should be able to get it through. That, so these, these guys are going to be very, very handy indeed. Uh, with the rise of the national romanticism sweeping all over Europe, your city administration needs to decide how to react. What is the role model for your forthcoming, for your forthcoming university? Swirelian for folklore. National Swirelian Party. Um, everyone's gonna like me. Of course, that's that's what you gotta do. Lack of confidence. Um, assure them that the Free Democratic Party can be trusted. Sure. Uh, anyone can start companies. That'll be coming online very, very soon. Uh, we are significantly in the hole right now, and it kind of worries me. Tempting opportunity. You have tried to deal with increasing rumors about your private life, at the same time as looking ways to fund your scientific endeavors. And then a solution presents itself. A wealthy financier called D'Angelo is looking for an influential husband for his daughter, Simona, but she has turned everyone down. The potential funding tempts you, so you decide to talk to Simona. Uh, try to be nice to her. I'm gonna be honest. Simona listens to your arguments and says that you're the first one of her, of her suitors that make any sense. Turns out that she has little interest for romance as you do. She is devoted to her life to riding and horses and is afraid that family life will take that from her. You promise her that she can continue doing whatever you want, uh, whatever she wants, and she has a, and you have a deal. Fantastic! I've managed to snag myself a wife. That is that is glorious. Um, we're in a pretty deep dark hole right now, and I don't really like that fact. I seem to be not doing particularly well. Um, service funding, we're going to cut this all back. We're going to cut this all back. Uh, clinic, you're going to get minus. Police station, you're going to get minus. 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 I think this is actually going to end up saving us like a shit ton of money, but it's obviously going to have, you know, a pretty bad effect on, wait a second, wait, can I do that? Did, is that going to make a difference? Like, did I change all of that stuff to make it perfect? Fingers crossed that that actually works. Now, this is going to have a horrendous effect on a bunch of stuff in the city, but hey ho. Uh, the port of Kashrafabian has grown quickly over the last couple of years, and there are all kinds of vessels from tiny fishing boats to gigantic steamships. Uh, and thanks to sailors, more foreign languages, but the sailors' quest for entertainment has caused some unrest. Uh, open a sailor's home where sailors can spend the night. Bonus to security, plus one. Fantastic. Uh, let's resume and continue going. So fingers crossed with the cutback of all of these services, it should free up a shit ton of money. Obviously, it's going to have a very, very bad effect to all of the averages across the board. But I think that honestly, that's pretty much what we need to do. Uh, it looks like this is going to get passed with flying colors. Because of course, we are in a very precarious financial situation right now. And let's go and see what my disastrous decisions have accomplished. Uh, we're still losing money. That's not good. Can I check my funding? Make sure that I actually set it to be all fine. Yeah, I can't minimize this stuff anymore. So I'm presuming that... I'm not even being paid for my job. God damn. We need to have a look at some of the expenses because our expenses are super, super high. Um, infrastructure. Darlington is the most expensive district, but that's only because we have electricity. Some don't even have gas. Everyone's got a road network. I mean, that's fine, I guess. Average Joe, Kildridge, they're only at 5% traffic capacity. Whatever the hell that means. 
no one's got any street lights or anything there's no cctv or any of that nonsense we haven't even discovered cctv yet uh, mayor's funding is non-existent infrastructure is still by far the largest like holy shit the largest and districts is also pretty damn big waltondale is there any chance of us demolishing this district for sodomy to be eased uh i don't really care brain power plus five to courthouse uh yeah actually let's support that i don't think it's going to be passed but sodomy is one of those things that just keeps on keeps on getting ticked over anyway um how do we demolish a district because i really do want to demolish a district yes great university uh, support sports clubs endorse romanticism all right let's get some dynamite considering that quite accurately represents uh how things are going right now and 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 what i want to do to our prospects uh, average joe can we get rid of average joe this is just an all-round uh industry uh commercial district and residential district so i feel kind of confident demolishing this it kind of costs a hell of a lot like we're not making we need to you know we need to check where are we actually making the income from we're making more income in all districts basically except this one here this one costs an utter shit ton uh We've got infrastructure. Should we just, like, take some infrastructure off of it? We, we gave it a fucking sewer system. We gave it everything. Okay, let's not fuck around with Waltondale for now. Because that is in a shit place. But I think, you know, we've got to get on top of this somehow. Average Joe, you're going to get demolished. Uh, everyone is super against it, apparently. I mean, I suppose we could modify and... make it so that I don't really want to do that I don't want to change the zoning I don't want to change everything I just want to I want to get rid of the district if at all possible but well either that or I want to modify it so that we take away the infrastructure that's costing us a lot of money gravel surface we can't take away their gravel surface from them. Damn them, damn them, damn them. I mean, is there a way to... Demolish this service? Is this a possibility? Required technology not re yet researched. Are you shitting me? Really? Hmm... Well, let's try and get it passed. We're going to give it our best shot. We're going to try and demolish that district, but I don't think it's going to work in the slightest. Uh, also, our financial situation is precarious, to say the least. But Darlington, holy shit, this, this place is making me a lot of money. Uh, this this is this is big moneyville over here. It's going real good. Uh, mild punishment for sodomy. Uh... Don't really care how it goes, to be honest. Sire Creatic, they've got nine council members. Uh, we should probably appeal these guys if we want to get this passed. Demand. Most citizens support this view. Uh, now we should get it passed, but... Just make... You know, we'll just give it a... We'll give them our best shot. And Sire Creatic again. We're going to plead with you. Ah, whatever. Let's do it. There we go. A pass is a pass is a pass. I'll take it. That's good enough for me. Brain power. Brain power is increased, which is great. Anyone can start companies. Now, this should be a no brainer, right? Although, this is pretty even. This is pretty, pretty even. Although this is the this has got the support of the Sire Creatic and This has got the support of the Free Democrats and the Sire Creatic, so I think this is gonna get passed to be honest.
Um, I think this is going to get passed. I'm very, very hopeful anyway. If it doesn't, that's really annoying. That's really annoying. That's so annoying. I'm going to just straight up overrule that. Anyone can start a company. You know, just do it. Just fucking do it. Don't let, don't let anyone stop you. Don't let anyone stop you, folks. Moral of the story. Uh, vote on destroying the district. This is not, this is not going to get passed. This is, this is, this is not getting passed, is it? This is not, this is not getting passed. Just ready for failure on that front. Average Joe, you're a fucking huge pain in the ass. Wow, look at that. Look at that. That is... I don't have enough prestige to do that, because holy shit, that would probably require a lot of prestige, which I obviously don't have right now. But average Joe is is costing me it's it's costing me a lot of money to, to keep up. Sure. Allow women to stand up in court. Why not? That seems completely reasonable. Is there any way that I can perhaps see if my is there any way that I can see like a history of the taxes and stuff because I would love to see if I actually lowered taxes if that would make any difference to my income should we try being really ballsy I'm gonna try being really ballsy quite quickly here um, taxing let's say business tax shit we can actually put that well up But none of them are really in favor of me putting it down. Making less money per month. Pretty much everyone is in favor of me putting it up. But no one's in favor of me putting it down. Well, I guess we'll propose that. In fact, no, let's not propose that. Let's, let's go bigger. Let's go up to 25%. In fact, 26% from businesses. So that's plus a substantial amount of money. But I don't know if it's going to make any difference. But I guess we'll see what happens in the next episode. Because holy shit, our financial situation is bad right now. Like, it's it's terrible. Anyway, ladies and gents, thank you very, very much for watching. My name, of course, has been Over the Potato. This has been Urban Empire. And I'll see you next time. Bye.